937 on our Saturday. Today is Juneteenth, the day to commemorate and celebrate the end of slavery. Events are happening all across the country and a few in our area. Joining us this morning is the communications director of Jack's Melon and Market, Anita Spencer. Good morning, Anita. Good morning, everybody. How are you today? I am fantastic. Well, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to talk with us this morning. When and where are events happening today to commemorate Juneteenth throughout Jacksonville and the greater area? Well, I know they're happening all over the city, but what I know about one in particular that I'm very fond of, we're going to be here today from 4 to 9 on A. Philip Randolph, which used to be called Florida Avenue. And we're here today to celebrate the 156th anniversary of the African-American emancipation here in the United States of America. And we're also celebrating the 150th birthday of James Weldon Johnson, who wrote our beloved Negro National Anthem. So this is going to be an amazing day for us. We're, we're all so excited. You know, earlier this week on James Weldon Johnson's birthday, uh, I had the opportunity to speak with Marsha Feltz. She's an author from Fernandina Beach uh, at American Beach. And I also spoke with Charlie Griffin. You might recall him. He was the man made famous by appearing in Life magazine on Axe Handle Saturday. So let me ask you this, Anita. What does today mean to you personally? Today means everything. And the reason why is because we stand on the shoulders and the backs of our ancestors. That's the reason that we're here. And it's important to me because we get to showcase black businesses that's in our community and we get to help others propel and push forward. So it's so it's so meaningful um, that we're being recognized. And this this is now being something that's official. It, it makes it feel like someone recognizes what's going on and that makes me feel just I can't even explain it I don't have words for it yeah you share the same sentiment with so many of us Americans uh, for people interested in this event specifically your event what can they expect when they head out today um we're gonna have over 200 businesses we're showcasing we're gonna have two stages of music we're gonna have two kids zones we're gonna have pony rides for the kids we're going to have petting zoos. We're going to have trains for them. We're going to be showcasing jazz musicians. So please bring your chairs, everybody, because it's going to be an amazing day. And you can expect to come out and just see businesses that are participating and excited about Juneteenth. But right. most importantly, what's going to be ha we're happy about the stadium is going to do fireworks for us. So we're excited. So we can we want families to come down and check out our fireworks show. And of course, you're just a few blocks north of where the stadium is. So that is perfect uh, location when it comes to a fireworks show. What do you want people to take away from today, whether they're going out to events to celebrate or if they're just sitting at home watching this segment now? What do you want people to take away from today, Juneteenth? I think I want people to take away compassion. I, I, and I say that because I think it's time for people to have a little bit more compassion for different cultures and different things that people celebrate. And today, no matter where you are, celebrate Juneteenth by just remembering the ancestors and just remembering some of the things that people have contributed to this country. And, and, and I think that's what I want people to take away. And I know on our website right now, Anita, newsforjacks.com, we have a whole list of uh, Juneteenth events happening throughout Jacksonville and the greater Jacksonville area. So if you are looking for an event, you can go out to the east side where Anita is, or you can stop by another event. We thank you so much for taking the time to speak with us today. No problem. Thank you, everybody. Come on out. We're going to have an amazing day. We're already setting up. So we love everybody. We'll see everybody soon.